Hello guys, welcome to another video in which we would be discussing iOS 18 how to fix can't login to some apps on iPhone. Are you having trouble that you're experiencing login issues with some apps after updating to the latest iOS 18? Don't worry, in this video we'll help you find a solution for it. Just follow these easy steps. 1. Check for update. Ensure that the app you're trying to log in is updated to the latest version. Go to App Store and search for any updates. If an update is available, install it. 2. Verify compatibility. Check the app's compatibility with your iOS version. Sometimes all the apps may not be compatible with the latest iOS updates. Look for the compatibility information in the app's details on the App Store. Scroll down till you find the compatibility details. 3. Disable autofill and password settings. Go to settings, then general. Now click on autofills and passwords. Ensure that the app password is not being autofilled incorrectly. Also, check for the settings for password and disable any options that might be interfering with the login process. 4. Disable face ID and passkey settings. If you're using face ID or passkey, Try disabling them temporarily to see if they are causing the issue. To do that, go back and click on Face ID and Passcode. Enter your passcode. Now, disable the Face ID. 5. Reset all settings. Most of the time, resetting all settings will sometimes help you resolve this issue. To reset all settings, go to General. Now scroll down till you find transfer or reset iPhone. Then click on reset and then reset all settings. This can sometimes resolve issues reset related to corrupted data or outdated versions. 7. Check internet connection. Ensure that your internet connection is stable. If you're using a mobile data, try switching to Wi-Fi and vice versa if necessary. 8. Restart your device. Sometimes a simple restart can resolve many issues. Restart your iPhone to see if it resolves the login problem. To restart your iPhone, press the volume up button and the volume down button. Now, the side button until you see the Apple logo appear. Lastly, contact app developer or support. If none of the above steps work, it might be specific issues with the app. Contact the app developer or Apple support for further assistance. Thank you for watching.